Today we're busting some myths in regards to preparing MLS gaskets for installation. Next. This video is sponsored by Mala, manufacturers of engine components, filters, and peripherals. Visit mala-aftermarket.com for more information. You've probably seen it in a couple different parts stores. It's the spray that you spray onto a head gasket. Chances are your grandpa did it, your father did it, but for today's modern gaskets, it's not required. This copper type spray is designed to help seal between the block and the head and it is sprayed on the head gasket and it is not necessary for today's gaskets. Today's gaskets have a rubber or polymer type material applied to them. Essentially it's printed on so it's the right thickness for the given area of the gasket. Essentially you have to have a clean head and a clean block for it to seal properly. And once you introduce one of these sprays or one of these coatings between the three elements, well, you're going to get a leak. And this matters also to composite gaskets, because essentially printed on this gasket is the gasket to seal against oil passages and also coolant passages in the head. So if you use one of these sprays on one of these modern gaskets, essentially you're introducing something that can leak. And also you could be affecting how the gasket moves between the block and the head when they expand and contract due to the heat cycles of the engine. So just keep that in mind the next time you're installing a set of gaskets. When you look inside the box of the gasket, look for any instructions. Those instructions will tell you if you need any sealants and where they should be applied. I'm Andrew Markell. Thank you very much.